As we know, the climate is changing and impacts are already being felt. Droughts and heat waves are predicted to increase, putting more pressure on valuable resources such as water. Industrial clusters where heavy industry is grouped together make up a third of all industrial and business carbon emissions in the UK. Decarbonising these clusters plays a key role in reducing carbon emissions and tackling climate change. However, they, like many industries, also rely on the environment. Understanding the critical interaction between heavy industry and the natural environment is paramount, while supporting sustainable low-carbon technologies such as carbon capture, storage and hydrogen production. Digital twins can help this understanding. A digital twin is a virtual replica of an object, system or environment, which can be altered to explore different scenarios and determine the real-world impact. Using a grant awarded by the Regulators Pioneer Fund, the Environment Agency has developed a proof-of-concept digital twin model of a low-carbon industrial cluster in the Humber estuary. It is built on Microsoft Technologies in partnership with Hitachi Solutions. The digital twin uses environmental and industrial data to assess the cumulative impacts of low-carbon technologies, focusing on water availability and temperature. It includes climate change projections to look at the potential impacts throughout the century and understand how water availability and higher water temperatures may affect the deployment of low-carbon technologies. The industrial cluster can be designed with the digital twin to explore how the impacts change as industries are added and resource requirements altered to find potential solutions. The proof of concept digital twin is the first step to exploring how we can use innovative technology to assess cumulative impacts, understand how the environment may impact low carbon industries, collaborating with government and industry to find solutions to regulate better for people, the environment and industry alike.